just finished a new painting of the Washington DC waterfront back in 1899 and I'd like to show it to you. Let's move in and I'll give you a closer look. On the horizon we see here the U.S. Capitol building and over here is the recently completed Library of Congress dome. This is a side wheel steamer docked at the waterfront that I have named the Young America. It's a name that I have found on many old prints of the day. This is a skipjack usually used for oyster fishing. This is a steam launch with some well-heeled passengers loading up, perhaps for an excursion down the river to Mount Vernon or Alexandria. And I couldn't resist placing this dog in the rowboat. He's based on my own dog. I did an awful lot of research into the old Washington waterfront using old maps, old prints, and old photos from sources like museums, state historical societies, and the Library of Congress. Back in 1899, the waterfront was lined with businesses like the Norfolk and Washington Steamboat Company and the Alexandria Ferry, the American Ice Company, there were oyster wharves, a firehouse, and even a morgue. Today, the waterfront is lined with marinas, seafood restaurants, condos, and offices. But this is my view of how the waterfront looked back when it was still a busy, bustling, working waterfront. This painting is being offered for sale by the National Maritime Historical Society.